nine fantastic fossil finds. Welcome to Throwback Thursdays. Number nine, making tracks. A huge dinosaur footprint was discovered hidden under a boulder in central Bolivia by a tour guide. The print, measuring four feet in diameter, is one of the biggest dinosaur tracks ever discovered and the biggest one found to date in that area. Paleontologists believe the trace fossil print belonged to an Abelosaurus, a creature that roamed the area some 80 million years ago. Abelosaurids were dominant predators in the southern hemisphere around the time Tyrannosaurids like T. rex were roaming Asia and North America, and they did resemble T-Rex with huge jaws used to crush and kill prey, but their arms were even smaller than Tyrannosaurus. While the normal size for Abelosaurids was around 9 meters, experts think this footprint belonged to a creature that exceeded 12 meters in length. Number 8. Yoho, Canada. A huge fossil site was found in Canada. The exact location is only accessible by helicopter and is being kept secret to prevent thieves from zeroing in on it. But it's said to be located in Kootenay National Park, around 42 kilometers away from the original site, Yoho National Park. Yoho's 500 million year old Burgess Shale has yielded some of the planet's earliest animals, including Pekaya, the most primitive known vertebrate and ancestor of all descendant vertebrates, including humans. Experts think the new site can equal the magnitude of the original site and has the potential to one day surpass it. 200 animal species have been identified over 600 field days at the original Burgess Shale discovery in Yoho National Park in over 100 years of research. But at the new site, 50 animal species were uncovered in only 15 days of field collection. Experts think more animal Animal species may eventually be found here than anywhere else in the world. Number 7. T-Rex of the Ocean Andrei Tayyirikov was scanning the shores of Wrangell Island in the Siberian Sea for mushrooms when he found a large stone which turned out to be the bones of a huge prehistoric creature dating back some 200 million years and belonged to one of the biggest dinosaurs that ever existed. Tyurikov was one of four scientists sent to Wrangell Island as part of an expedition for a large energy concern. He took the bone back to St. Petersburg where it was analyzed by experts and identified as actually two bones from a plesiosaur, a massive marine reptile often referred to as a sea monster. They were fearsome creatures with extremely long necks, a body around 40 feet long, and cucumber-sized teeth. Because of their tendency to feed on other marine reptiles, some experts have described them as the T-Rex of the ocean. Further testing on the fossilized remains was still to be conducted. Number 6. A mammoth mystery. A complete mammoth skull was recently discovered on the California island of Santa Rosa, and the unique fossil has experts baffled. Its size is between that of a Colombian mammoth and a pygmy mammoth, but has not been positively identified as either. Researchers believe its true identity will be revealed by its fossilized teeth. Colombian mammoths are thought to have inhabited North America during the Pleistocene epoch, between 1.8 million and nearly 12,000 years ago. The animals could reach 13 feet high and weigh up to 22,000 pounds. Pygmy mammoths could stand over five and a half feet tall and weigh around 1,700 pounds, although some sources estimate those numbers higher. Researchers say this is an extremely rare mammoth find and could offer some big clues as to human migration and what caused the mammoths to go extinct. The creature has features unlike any of its kind. Do you think it could be a Colombian or pygmy mammoth or maybe some unknown transitional mammoth species? Number 5. Macamosaurus rex. The saltwater crocodile is the largest reptile and largest terrestrial predator, measuring up to 23 feet and weighing over 2,500 pounds. But paleontologists recently revealed the fossil remains of a mega crocodile that measured 30 feet long and weighed up to three tons. It's believed to be the largest ocean-dwelling croc in the world and was discovered buried in the sands of the Sahara Desert. Except for its massive size and narrow snout, M. rex would have resembled a modern-day crocodile. It was an apex predator with a powerful bite force and likely ate fish and turtles. The fossils have been dated back some 130 million years ago, indicating the creatures were still alive at the end of the Cretaceous period, which contradicts a belief that this group of crocodiles went extinct during the Jurassic period. 
Number four. Natural Trap Cave. An accidental discovery occurred when scientists explored a deep cave in hopes of finding the remains of Ice Age mammals. Instead, they stumbled onto a treasure trove of hundreds of large prehistoric animals. Excavations at the Natural Trap Cave in Wyoming have yielded the fossils of mammoths, short-faced bears, and camels that inhabited North America during the Ice Age. The cave's natural trap is actually a bell-shaped opening, 15 feet wide, that leads to an 85-foot drop. Researchers think the animals fell in while seeking shelter. Over time, that led to a layer of bones, 30 feet deep at the cave's bottom, where cool temperatures kept the remains well preserved. A dig in 2014 excavated remains of wolves, lions, and the American cheetah, among other finds, some of which were nearly complete specimens and dated back some 13,000 years. Researchers think the fossil discoveries will help them better understand why many of these animals went extinct during the late Pleistocene epoch. Number 3. Siberosaurus. The fossilized bones of this huge animal were first found in 2008, embedded in a Siberian cliff face. After eight years of painstaking excavation, experts pieced the bone fragments together, constructing a picture of the creature. It was a massive beast that roamed the Earth 100 million years ago and belonged to the sauropods, a class of huge, herbivorous dinosaurs known for the long necks. This adult specimen was thought to measure 66 feet long and weigh over 110 thousand pounds. Full details of the creature are forthcoming from Russian researchers, but they feel this could actually be a completely new type of plant-eating dinosaur related to the Titanosaur, a diverse group of sauropod dinosaurs that include some of the heaviest creatures to ever walk the earth. While the monster's official Latin name is forthcoming, it goes by the nickname Siberosaurus. Number two, C-Rex. One of the best preserved and most significant fossil discoveries ever was made by Kevin Sheehan, a retired cafe owner and fossil hunter from Dorset, England, who spent five years unearthing it. The fossil belongs to a creature thought to have weighed over 26,000 pounds, measured 60 feet long, swallowed great white sharks whole, and had a bite force powerful enough to shred a car in half. This fearsome animal is named Kevin, or it could be Kevin because it's spelled K-E-V-A-N, although its proper name is Plesiosaurus Kevani. The gargantuan beast would have ruled the ocean some 150 million years ago. Its massive jaws were filled with 12-inch teeth, thought to have given it the biggest bite in history. And while it probably could have snapped up T-Rex for lunch, it fed primarily on ichthyosaurs and mass quantities of squid. Number one. While Argentinosaurus currently holds the record for being both the longest and heaviest land animal ever at around 100 feet long and weighing up to 73 tons, it may have to surrender its title to a new champ. The bones of a new species of Titanosaur were discovered in Argentina that could have been as heavy as 14 African elephants, or around 170,000 pounds. Standing with its neck up, the herbivorous creature would have been around 65 feet tall, about the height of a seven-story building. From measuring the gigantic thigh bones that would have been around 130 feet long. These sauropods were characterized by their small heads, long necks, and whip-like tails, and date from the Cretaceous period. This titanosaur would have lived in the Patagonian forests of Argentina and Chile up to 100 million years ago. The massive fossilized bones were discovered in 2013 by a local farm worker in a region of southern Argentina that has produced many important dinosaur fossil finds. These bones are said to be the largest set of dinosaur remains ever found to date. <laughs>